With the release of Christopher Nolan's Oppenheimer days away, the PR machine is in full swing, and one of their pieces claims that the Trinity test left behind a crater 1.5 miles across. This is not true. The Trinity test was a test of an implosion-type plutonium weapon, the same kind that would be used at Nagasaki. A big part of the test is they didn't know exactly how powerful the bomb might be. Many estimates put the yield at about 10 kilotons, but in fact the detonation was 25 kilotons. And as you might imagine, it did leave behind something of a crater on the desert floor, but it was only a few feet deep. Here's Robert Oppenheimer and many other leaders of the Manhattan Project examining the foundations of the shot tower. The inner crater radius was only about 300 feet across, but you can see beyond that, the road survived. The surface was disturbed out to 500 feet radius, and areas were melted over a thousand feet away. And yet marketing didn't think this was impressive enough. 